In psychology, people who get angry easily aren't necessarily bad tempered. What's really happening is that their stress tolerance is very low. Instead of staying calm, their body reacts as if it's in danger and instantly switches into fight mode. A small inconvenience, a careless word, or a sudden change in plans can feel like an attack. And anger becomes the fastest way their brain knows to release all that tension. This reaction often starts in childhood in environments where emotions were ignored or punished. When someone grows up without a safe way to express sadness, fear, or disappointment, those emotions get stored, and later, they come out as anger. Because anger feels powerful while sadness feels weak and exposed. Over time, the brain learns to use anger automatically, even in situations that don't really need it. The truth is, anger itself isn't the enemy. It's just a signal that something deeper is hurting, stress, pain, or the feeling of not being seen. But when anger becomes the only reaction, it can push people away and create the very loneliness that fuels it. If you see yourself in this, remember your anger isn't proof that you're broken. It's proof that your body is tired from carrying pain that never had words. Learning to pause before reacting is a weakness. It's giving yourself the chanchetto finally be heard without burning everything around you. VNBN McNH. If this resonates, share it with your friends and don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow DOB Psychology for simple brain insights and gentle ways to understand your own mind.